I thought 10 years ago would have been a good time to have done Sea Change again because you could have caught up with all the people who were in it originally. Now, having waited another 10, there's probably a few of us whose stories are worth uh, catching up on, but now there's a generation underneath, and Miranda is the personification of that, whose stories um, are at their most interesting. Well, Sea Change 20 years later, doing a reboot, I thought long and hard about it when the opportunity came along and, uh, and I realised quite quickly that there was never a better time. Um, it sounds Pollyanna-ish, in fact the opposite is the case. We're living in a, a more complicated world uh, and a world where a show that's um, discussing connection, uh, community, love, goodwill, the, uh, the notion of social responsibility is more timely than ever. So I think, uh, I think that's why it's almost a generation later, this kind of sea change seems completely relevant. I was a fan of sea change, yes, back in 1999, <clears throat> the day before Netflix and Stan and everything else. And uh, I, I just fell in love with those characters, you know, Tom Long and Kate Atkinson, of course, Sigrid and Bob Jelly and, and Kevin Harrington's Coders, you know, uh, it was something we watched, you know, every week. I watched it as a, with my family. That was what we did, you know. We watched Sea Change as a family and my father, um, who was this, you know, gruff old Serbian man, just really those those moments at the end, he, he found them so profound and we all did. And it was just beautiful to see him moved like that. Getting the old gang back is fantastic. John Howard and I, we actually write little um, notes to each other when we're not in the same city. Like, little, he, he's, Dal, I miss you, I miss your cupcakes. Dal, where are the keys? And we sort of bob and, and heather ourselves. Being back with the original team is just a delight because we all had the most brilliant time on the first show. For me, it was a very particularly special time of life, um, the first series. It happened at a particular, with particular timing, it was a wonderful role, it gave me an opportunity to re reinvent myself at the time as an actress and uh, so I, it, it always had a sort of special place for me and uh, lie me down, you know, who <laughs> would have thunk really that we'd find ourselves here and we keep sort of nudging each other and going, hey this is pretty good, you know, how about this?